Well, Congress is getting ready to reauthorize Michelle Obama's Healthy Hunger-Free Kids Act for this year. Now, obviously, we have seen some of these horrendous lunches, but students and parents are continuing to post photographic evidence of this program's shortcomings. Schools are, of course, complaining of increased costs and waste because these so-called healthy meals are being trashed. Just look at this disgusting lunch. What about that says healthy? It is processed salami meat and cheese. The salami is two different colors. It's moldy, and it's inside of a tortilla. <laughs> and if you scroll down, I mean, it doesn't get any better. That looks disgusting. Nothing about that says healthy. I'm sure those carrots have been canned for the past four years. This looks like prison food. This is what is supposed to be the brain food for your children to make it through the rest of the day. We already know how GMOs and processed foods and food additives and things like this can make kids with ADD get even more excitable during class. Look at that. That is disgusting. Meanwhile, Michelle has an organic garden at the White House, and she's forcing this kind of crap on your kids. And, you know, then we've reported that schools are basically telling parents that they can't pack a lunch for their own children, that the children have to be invested in this program at school. That's disgusting.